Hey guys, so I'm thinking about converting my room into an office and my plan is to, or what I'm thinking, is taking my bed frame and building legs to it so it raises up as a desktop. So I'm gonna have a queen size work table and then I'm just gonna put my mattress underneath. Um, it's an Ikea box frame and it's got drawers. And the idea is to attach the legs down here and raise it up. So to start, just got these four by fours from the garage. And might not be at the right height, but might be a good start. We'll see if they work and go from there. I got a food time. something about this thing or cut this notch out into the 4x4 so that I get clearance to screw uh, that in right there another option would be getting a 4x or 2x4 and constructing my own little square coming off of that so what I finally decided to do was take these rails and flip it onto the other side. So it looks like that. And it's gonna be sitting, the legs are gonna be mounted onto this side, which is a top face uh, currently, but I'm gonna turn the whole box upside down and mount the legs on this thing, on this side, because it's nice and flat. It's got a much easier place to screw through and now this is going to be the tabletop and it's going to give it some lip here um so it's going to stick out like that so sizing can be different if i wanted to and those slats that was on the top it's now going to be on the underside which might give me uh, a place to hang some stuff for sleeping or just for like hanging a laptop or something could be useful, so I wanted that on the bottom.
there's not much gap here. I'm just gonna use crescent and fill. <laughs> Socket set.
All right. It works good. All that's left is to put a plywood top on here and it'll be a giant work table. Hey, thank you so much for watching the uh, part one of the queen size desk. This is the part one of a long series and uh, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, obviously the camera that I was using was my iPhone C 5C. So the quality isn't so great, but it'll get better as we uh, keep going through the weeks. If you have any questions, if you want to comment, give me feedback, uh, please do so in the comment box below. Um, I will always read your feedback and uh, get back to you if I can. I just started this YouTube channel um, and also I just started a Patreon page. So it would mean the world if you subscribe and to be my patron and support what I do. Um, I personally don't like ads on uh, the videos I watch on YouTube, so I don't think I'm going to be doing that uh, and then solely uh, try to get funding through Patreon. So if you liked my content and you want to see more of it and want to join in the projects that I work on, support me on Patreon and uh, let's do some more projects. Thanks for watching.